it's Sheeta coming to you from Mexico City. I am in the first Airbnb that I rented when I got here. I'm leaving today to go stay in an apartment that might be my, not forever home, but my home for maybe a couple of months. It is a co-living space and I'm not great at living with other people, so this should be interesting for me. Um, about this Airbnb, I really like it a lot. There's only one thing I don't like about it and I don't know if you can see it. Oh, that doorknob there. Boop. That doorknob is just one of those push locks. You just turn the handle and it opens and that's it. And that's, that's it. Uh, there's security downstairs and you can't get into the building without a key. Security's 24 hours. So I do feel safe here. I would feel safer if the lock was a little bit more rigorous, I guess. I don't know. Um, also, this neighborhood is interesting. I, when I pulled up, I saw the sign that said Coliseo big red sign it's on a pink building and I remembered I've been here before I came here before once uh, to see uh, the luchadores wrestle because it's this big Mexican wrestling venue um, I think one of the most popular ones or, or the biggest one in town it's where everyone said to go but they also said when I was going there that I should be careful there at night be very very careful and so when I'm driving down the street and I realize I'm about a block away actually less than a block um, and I see that that's there. I'm like, oh, okay, where am I staying? Uh, the neighborhood is fine. You know me, I'm always fine. A few exceptions. Um, I really like it here. There's something about the building. The building is brand new. It is the only new building I've seen in this neighborhood. It is gentrification. It is the oncoming of gentrification. Um, not only is it a new building, but I checked in with a security guard to see if there were any units for rent in this building, and he told me that there weren't because every single unit was used as an Airbnb. Which makes me really sad. It makes me sad that in a neighborhood in Mexico, there isn't a place for locals in the building. Um, I know Airbnb serves its purpose, just like other um, companies in the industry, but that kind of, like a whole building that is just Airbnb, gave me, uh, made me a little uncomfortable. But, okay, so I'm moving on today, going to a co-living space. I'm in Zocalo now, which is um, six blocks from like the historic center of Mexico. This is actually called the historic center of Mexico City, but the that big, there's a uh, really big cathedral and I think some kind of government building, I don't know what it is. Like the actual historic center of Mexico City is just down the street and I walked there yesterday. Great walk, I feel really safe, I really like it here. But I'm moving to Roma today, Roma Norte. I'm gonna stay there for a couple of days, see if I like the place. If I do, I might rent it for a longer period, one to three months just to see, get a feel of Mexico City before I really rent something long term. So I'm excited about what's ahead. I have had a good few days so far. I got called Chica a few times and Morena and I gotta say I like it. Um, and so yeah, I'm gonna work on my Spanish. I'm going to see the sights and eat the food until the next update. So for now, bye!